I only had cancer for eight days. Uh, September 22nd, 2010, uh, I was in remission, but the protocol is to go through the full round of treatment. So I went through about three and a half years, regardless of the fact that I was in remission so early. I was diagnosed with uh, ALL, which is acute lymphoblastic leukemia, just two weeks before my 14th birthday. And I went through nine months of really intense chemotherapy until I got to the final stage of my treatment, which was supposed to last about three years, but it had to cut had to be cut short because I had liver failure due to the effects of the chemotherapy. And over the course of the next year, my liver recovered, and I've been going to the doctor ever since to keep a check on my cancer, and it hasn't returned. When I was first diagnosed, they told me that I might never play basketball again. And you know, from that moment, I decided that I disagreed with them, and I was going to take every opportunity I could to prove them wrong. So I was like, well, you're wrong. I'm going to play. Not only am I going to play college basketball, I'm going to play high school basketball. And the first thing that started, they told me I was going to lose my hair, and I said I wouldn't, and I never did. They told me I couldn't exercise, and I argued and argued until they let me do it. They let me do like small weight lifts, and I said, this isn't enough, I need to do more. And I continued to push them until they let me do what I wanted to do. And eventually I was able to make uh, the JV team as a freshman, just uh, nine months off of chemotherapy, or nine months into chemotherapy. And then I made varsity my sophomore, junior, and senior years all playing on chemo. And then uh, I got recruited by UW Oshkosh, and I've been playing ever since then. The advice I would give to someone with a similar situation would be to just keep working hard and never get down on yourself. Um, there's really nothing that can prevent you from doing what you want to do if you put in the work that's required.